Uh, team goals, you know, uh, sat down and looked, and on paper, um, going in on guys and girls' side, we're, we're sitting third um, if their meet were to be done strictly on uh, performances. Uh, so obviously you don't want to finish where you're ranked, you want to finish above that. So we were talking about goals as far as what we need to do to finish second and, and maybe even flirt with, uh, with victory too. Uh, we're looking to go in and uh, try to score multiple, uh, multiple people in multiple events. Uh, the men's hurdles look to be really strong for us. Um, women's four, women's two, um, you know, all the way across the board, we've got uh, pretty strong sprints and hurdles. Last week, Frankie uh, ran really, really well. Um, Shane's been running very well, um, both at ECAC and the uh, 60 hurdles. Um, Anastasia, been doing fantastic. Um, school record in the, the 400, 300 earlier in the year, um, leading conference in the 200. Um, Nicodemus from the football team. Um, he's been running very well in the two and the uh, 60 dash. Uh, we've got three great hurdlers uh, this last weekend as far as how it finished. You know, Frank, um, Shane, and Hoover. Um, and the great thing about those three guys, it, it's completely interchangeable. Um, you know, this weekend it could be the exact flip-flop uh, as far as who finishes in front of who. Uh, but they, they work out uh, well together. They all three have, have different personalities, but they get along great. They compete well. They practice well. Uh, and right now they're sitting, uh, those three guys are in the top four in the conference right now in, in the hurdles. I'm really looking forward into hopefully winning the 400 and the 200. I never really like to jinx myself. I pretty much just go out there and say, you know, run as hard as you can. And even when I get tired, I just think about practice and how hard that we have to work. But I can say that our really team is very close. We've all worked very hard together. Um, we're looking to keep heading for second and first, you know, keeping on top is what we really want to do. Um, individually, uh, we're going to be running at a great facility against some really good competition. So uh, I'd really like to perform well against the other competition. Um, going into hurdles, I really want to break 8-4. Uh, that's kind of the time to be right now if you want to be in the national rankings. And uh, for this weekend, I want to do my best to win the meet for hurdles. Um, and for the 200, I'd really like to break into the 23 second range. My college goal has always been to break 26 and to get down to 25s and 200. So I think that's my personal season goal eventually. Um, the 400 just breaking sub 60 was awesome for me. I've always wanted to do that. So I'm hoping to get it down to 58 if I can. Um, that's all with, with given time. But if I keep working hard and training right and eating right, then I think it's possible to do such. Um, coach has been really pushing us at practice and in the weight room. Uh, this year we've been going twice a week to Hamilton in the morning. 545 so we've been getting at it and uh, I think they're doing a really good job preparing us for the upcoming season. As, as any program would have you know your juniors and seniors you expect a lot of because they know exactly what's uh, expected of them. They know what needs to be done um, whether the coach is looking or not they take care of the things that they need to do the little things that make the difference at the end of the season. Yeah and, and this week it's been really exciting uh, you know uh, you made mention that Empire rates a little early in the season and I actually I really enjoy that because it gives the kids something right away to, to to gun for. Uh, you know, we've had two weeks of practice before this week, uh, and it's nice when we're doing some of the tougher things uh, as we generally do the first couple weeks that the kids can still get excited and know that what they're doing is going to pay off uh, in a couple weeks when they go after it in the championship. So we're all really, really excited for this weekend.